Are you an experienced Dungeons and Dragons player with years of campaigns under your belt? Or are you just entering the D&D community and already feel stifled by the limited character options? Lucky for you, there's homebrew. Homebrew is unofficial supplementary rule material used to expand your character options. There are thousands of homebrew products out there, and today, I'll be sharing one of them with you. A creation of my own, the Paladin Oath of Dreams. I've been writing homebrew since 2018, also the year that I started DMing and playing D&D, but only in the past two years have I really ramped up production. I've published some material on my website, linked below, but I have dozens of unpublished classes and subclasses just sitting around, completed but unpublished. A channel I really admire is Struthless. He's an Australian artist who makes videos about personal development. His most recent project is a project for his community of artists, including me. It's all about creating one piece of art, could be anything, once a week and sharing it with the world. It's called Letter Quest because it uses the alphabet to create creative constraints. I'm participating in Letter Quest and decided to achieve multiple goals with one purpose. I've decided to expand my character profile painting skills while publishing my unpublished homebrew. Each week, I'll be making a full body portrait of a character from my games whose name starts with the corresponding letter and who, mechanically, uses at least one homebrew class or subclass that I've written. Week number one. A. Aster, comma, Ognanimus. The gnomish train conductor for the Beatnik Persuasion, a school for misfits aboard a train. Dreams are sometimes thought of as the closest thing we have to an afterlife. At the very least, this liminal space of the subconscious is indicative of deeper levels of personality, truth, and aspiration. Knights of the dream space are champions of these qualities. They are wardens of the mind, and as such are uniquely qualified for influencing others' perceptions of it. As a paladin of the Oath of Dreams, consider what your goals are, and the reasons behind those goals. Consider how these aspirations affect your perception of reality be it in the subconscious or conscious space? Do they offer constructive lucidity, or do your dreams skew your perspective? Tenets of dreams. Aspiration. Aim high and strive to live out all of your dreams. Subtlety. While ambitious, understand that you do not need to flout your passion. Instead, act diligently to achieve your goals, needing neither praise nor recognition for your work. Rest. Reminiscence, or improvement through rest, is as vital for growth as activity. Ognanimus Aster is an elderly gentleman known for working as a train conductor aboard the Beatnik Persuasion, a school for outliers. He sports an embroidered top hat, a curling moustache, and a monocle. Mr. Aster is not one of the main characters of this story, but he has a story of his own. Hailing from Bloodrock Haven, Og worked as a spy for the rebels fighting the oppression of the vampiric priests running the city. Throughout his life, he has donned the cap of spy, soldier, cook, adventurer, and librarian. Now it is springtime in Dromnost, and we enter at the Neonoir train station just outside of town. Excitement bubbles forth from the amassed students thronging outside of the copper steam train, chattering voices filling the air. The Paladin Oath of Dreams can be found at my website, FindingMason.com, linked below. There are already a multitude of homebrew subclasses there, and it would mean the world to me if you gave them a look. I have big projects ahead. Aside from publishing all of these character videos and their corresponding mechanics, I'm also finalizing details on two entirely original homebrew classes for 5e, The Replicator and The Bloodbound. With each document I write, I grow and the work that I will be publishing going forward is all material that I couldn't be prouder of. Look forward to next week's video, featuring the Bloodborne Sorcerer known as Bloody Bone. Peace.